All right. So number two, develop develop a C plus plus program from the user to enter a working hour. So we need a working hour, and hourly pay rate, and then uh you will get the gross pay. It's okay. And now let's do it right now. So first, let's have a golden seven number two. We have chapter five, classwork two. Let's have a golden seven line. So right now, first of all, we need to have working hours. Even though working hour you may feel like a、uh, forty, but sometimes forty point five. So we want to put double and working. Let's just put work hours, okay? Then、uh, we need hourly rate. Hourly rate, rate、uh, pay. Hour pay rate. So we need that. Then、uh, also we also need the gross pay. All right. So we need that、uh, three things. So working hours and hourly pay rate and gross pay. So let's control this right now. Do you think that you know working hour can be negative? Do you think working hour can be negative? Nah. All right. So the working hour will be reasonable. Will be reasonable. You know, we may have fifty hours, so ten hours over 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 low, or twenty hours over low. Is that possible? We have two hundred hours over low. Is that possible? No. And as a matter of fact, that's a problem. Some company, some company, they. They will allow the user to enter anything. So there's a mistake. They have five thousand hours for, you know, so overload. So what do you think? Can we decide what would be a good, ah,、uh, reasonable number for the working hour? For example, if you work at the、uh, Kmart or or work with Walmart, what would be the reasonable hours we should put in, you know, the forty hour plus overload? What do you think? Sixty hours, Gregory. That's good. So now let's do it right now. So you want to enter between zero to sixty, all right? So between zero to sixty, we process. Now, if that's outside this, if outside this, we are going to say that's invalid input. So can you write it for me? We write it right now. For first of all, you need to say C out. Enter. Uh, work working hours is that right? We we need to do that then, but then we're going to say that okay between zero to sixty. You understand? You're going to tell them that hey, uh, you know the system will block you. The system will block you. So they see in and uh work hours. All right. So I need you create a if statement here. Create an if statement here. Then,、uh, if this is uh, between uh, zero to sixty, then you process. Okay, then you process. All right,、uh, gross pay. All right, else here, else here, and you see how <coughs> invalid. So. I'm going to ask you to write line number nine for me. So this is a、uh, line number nine and line number fourteen. Okay, so you see, who is the first one? Can put line number nine for me. If line number nine. All right, Jeffrey. Working hours greater than zero. Working hours less than sixty. Super. I really like you. Okay. So I'm going to put like this right now. 
so we're going to process here all right so this is between this and as a matter of fact we uh probably can do greater than zero only okay then uh otherwise see how or if not what we can say right here anybody anybody want to if this is not then what we supposed to say anybody so if if then in value input Dylan okay very good in value we hung great job all right so I'm going to take Dylan's uh we hung is a good too but I'm going to take Dylan's right here invalid input enter working hour between 0 to 60 all right so by the way since we put 0 so we have to put equal so all right so right here we are okay right now everybody now that's working on inside here they are okay right now so inside here you have you have two choice is that right if uh let me see work hours okay is greater than 40 all right 40 then we we do this okay we do gross pay equal all right so else we do gross pay equal sorry else where's my else uh, else all right so so far okay right now so I am going to ask you to do number one okay let's do this okay uh let's do the don't do the overload right now all right so uh if yeah we need to find out the hourly pay rate super good i forgot that okay so once here right now once here once check here all right then if these then we need to find out hourly pay, pay rate okay we all need to find out hourly pay rate uh if uh if the hours is wrong is that right okay oh okay. can oh hold on just, yeah 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 that's right we're going to do that right now so i'm going to say see how enter the uh, hourly pay rate is that right pay rate all right so once we enter that right now then we're going to see in and this is hourly pay rate okay so far okay now we are better right now so we want to say that uh continue sorry continue so if my hourly is uh between is between uh let me pull like this let me pull like this less than equal 40. less than equal 40. so this is regular hours all right if that's regular hours can anyone tell me how to do my gross pay anybody anybody that's right mm -hmm. all right good all right so now over time right now else that means over time all right so how do you do that anybody i want you think about it first and anybody tell me okay so now uh, who is this one who's a smart kid tell me this what's your name caesar. all right caesar so let me ask you this if you want me to write like this i want to say this 
is you want to do uh, this and times 1.5 is that what you want me to do All right, so the yeah, okay, no, okay, Dylan, uh, you guys are too generous. Okay, too nice. All right, because, all right, that's right. Because you really you do not pay. Don't need only pay. See, like Lydia say. Only over 40 hours pay like that. Only only over 40 hours. Is that right? So what you need to do is this right now. So working hours times that, let's do this. Okay, let's do this. All right, so only 40 hours. All right, so you want to do this. 40 hours times we don't need to because we can we can do it right now 40 because we know that 40 hours you understand so your 40 hours times your pay rate plus all right then your work hours minus 40 is that right and times your hourly rate and times 1.5 all right so but make sure uh, we have a parenthesis around this question why why is it do it like that because if do we do the else statement so we need to declare that if the work hour is less than 40 and, or less than or equal to 40 any other input that goes into the if Okay, so this less than 40, they don't have overtime. Now we have overtime. The second, the line 16, line 16 is the people who have uh, overtime. Yeah, yeah. So, uh, 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 Dylan, uh, are you okay, Dylan? Your suggestion? Yeah, I missed it too. Okay, sorry, sorry, sorry. I changed it, okay? Alright, sorry. Now, do you understand now? Yes or no? Let's try it right now. It's okay? Let's try it right now. So we build it. We build it. And and we start without debugging. First, we put 100 hours. And the system should block you. Do you understand? You want to be able to block the invalid input. So let's do it right now again. So I'm going to put uh, 55 hours. All right. Once I put 55 hours, it will prompt me to enter the hourly rate. So 15, let's put $10. So this is easier to calculate. So it's a 400. Is that right? So, oh, you know what? I did not uh, print it out. Is that right? So uh, out of these working out of these, I need to say C out. Okay. All right, so we I I forgot to print it out. So I need to build it again, rebuild it. 
all right and start without debugging so i'm going to say this again uh, i don't need to try 100 i try already that's 250 hours okay so and let's do ten dollars so now it's 10 times uh 40 400 uh another 10 hour times 1.5 is 550 so do you understand this question or not yes or no so now you for this you will understand this you have if else and you have another if else inside this all right so when you deal with if else really you are dealing with uh you know from two to four different options from two to four different options all right so this is your number two this is your number two i hope you understand it and i hope uh i did not confuse you all right so 